What is this? Off limits. No, I'm oh, sorry. Uh, unauthorized act, uh, unauthorized entry beyond this point will be punished. No exceptions. If in doubt, consult with an officer of the administration by direct order of the thief taker general. Ah, yes. No one's allowed back here. No one but me. Oh, that's what this is. Fun. Okay. So that door is open now. I'm not gonna worry about the glass anymore, apparently. Because people in that room can't seem to hear a fight, so stepping all over this glass isn't gonna mean a thing. Alright. Let's not be hasty. I think I was a little bit overconfident with the lock here. I've done so well with them so far, I just kind of felt like I could zip through any of them. Oh, wait. Is that also a key? Fun. No one's allowed in here. Hook back onto the assembly line. Fine, fine. That's how we have to do things. There's always a little save marker in the top left whenever I get into one of these things. Lots of chests all over the place here, which is very good. They've all held very useful things so far. Whoa! Was that 30 gold? I actually would have thought they'd be those would be worth more. Stop here for me, thank you. And let's keep it moving. Could drop here, but I decide not to, because. Actually, I don't see why not. I'd probably get where I'm going faster if I did. Oh, apparently, no, I can't drop here. Then patiently we wait, dear viewers. For a dead man, Cornelius is proving hard to catch. But I'll have to if I'm to pawn that ring. Oh, hey, one at a time. <laughs> No pushing. <laughs> Flames ain't going anywhere without you. Flames. No matter if you're rich or ragged, beggared or buttered up. What I want to know is why these sickos take such delight in all this. Mother's got the fucking clone. She's not coming to live with us. Yeah. <laughs> you take a general sir. Excuse me, sir. 
what did this body have on it? <laughs> Nothing. No, I was just going to get another body when you came in and took over. <laughs> you know, I don't ask for much. Respect. Stiff drink. Gold. And for my men to do what they're fucking told. Put his body in the furnace. Check it for coin. No point in wasting a bolt. Robbing the dead of their valuables and their dignity. A thief taker general exceeds his own reputation. Time to steal everything back. <laughs> Garrett. The only thing you weren't going to rob the dead of were their dignity. Their valuables you were definitely about to take. Of course. Only because you were hired to do so, I get that. That was three days. Hey, uh. bet wasn't. Double or nothing. Shipping procedure. Remove any remaining clothing, search thoroughly, check the lining. Also boots and belt, check inside boots. And the belt buckle of any, place any jewelry inside collection tray. Look for necklaces, earrings, watches, bracelets, rings and such. Don't forget inside the mouth. Throw corpse and clothing in the furnace and repeat. Remember, you will be searched at the end of your shift. Thieves will be hung from the neck until dead. And apparently shot right in the face for doing their job. Not me. General wanted that ring, all right. What was that about? Where's the tray? Stick your nose out. Still, didn't see many bodies with rings until then. Hey, you don't suppose we uh, should be checking for um, cock rings and stuff, do you? It's a ring. You know. No, no. Some people have stuff like that. <laughs> what is wrong with these guys? It helps with getting it up or something. My brother, Daniel, knew a blossom. She said if you're in a pinch, you can use the gut. Tied in a knot. I'm here with you. You're telling me about your dog in a knot? No, no, no. Not at all. Don't let me go, my brother. He's half gone. Not surprised. Come to think of it, I should give Brahms one. This place makes for interesting maneuvering. said she hates me. But honestly, this entire place is making me a little bit sick to my stomach. Where is that collection tray? Find another way into the office to steal a ring from the general. Peer through a small hole. Too much to hope. Cleaned it, I suppose. All right, so I've got to get in there. I can't get in from that way. So. We'll search along these lines. Okay. The further I get away from all the dead bodies, the better. I can't wait for this to be done. This is that part of the game that whenever you think about playing it again in the future, you're like, oh, I remember that part, and then you don't want to play it again. This is that part. That's a strong box. Another of the Baron's improvements, perhaps. It'll crack like any other. Oh, 
don't suppose he's coming back anytime soon. This thing rigged. We have an alarm somewhere. Is there a light switch? There's no light switch by the door? What kind of room design is this? Well, I guess I'd better hurry. Oh, what am I doing? I have no idea how this works. One, two, three layers. So we'll start on this layer. We turn everything this way. We come over to this layer. Do that. Nope, nope. One less time. How does this even work? Oh, this is going to take a while. Nope. Nobles never miss an opportunity to admire their own crest. Nice. Give me all this stuff and let's get out of here. Cornelius. I don't need to pick the lock. Getting I out of here. Ring and a new best friend, but it's not over until I get out of here. All right then. Cornelius's ring, a signet ring, retrieved from the corpse of a recently deceased aristocrat. Why does Basso want this? This doesn't look like a noble crest. This looks like a piece of machinery. It's part of something. Ugh. But I really am feeling sick to my stomach because of all this. Because of this mission. Okay. Let's get a look at where we've got to go. But I've got to get out that way. And heading this way is probably not going to do me any good now, is it? Okay, where am I? There we go. Got to get out. Got to find a way out. Um, I think I really should pick that door. They're probably going to try and break it down, though. Where am I going? Can't swoop in here. whole place is going to be on alert now. Thief Taker General doesn't seem too intent on getting in here. He's probably good enough at his job to realize that if there was a way in for me, that there was a way out without using that door. thinking that he might not suspect the use of the other door. Swear I heard the general. He was. We're better off out here. <laughs> Good point. I'll go in. You owe me, Bleeter. She'll never know. Is it the docks on the way home? It's where are you headed? Oh, he's turning on lights and stuff. And coming back, that he is. Doesn't feel safe on the streets. You know what, buddy? That one actually didn't set right. No? Oh, wrong arrow. Oh, I'm out of water arrows. Uh oh. That's no good. Stuck in the light right now because of his torch. And now I'll be. Covered. Hope something happens to me. Okay. Doesn't look like there's ever any light here, which is good. Same every night. Close this off. We're doing this. <laughs> ah. <clears throat> this factory's a metal coffin. Should have been buried. So I can get down through here, or I could take this door. Well, I sneak out here to hunt for big rats when I was younger. It was abandoned back then. It's the barrier, you Wish I could lean without having to peek. Jump down, put those candles out. 
sometimes it pays to move quickly, and sometimes it pays to be patient. Rats everywhere. This put out your torch, I wonder. You know what? I'm got to be patient here. <laughs> <clears throat> Step out this way. What's nope. Happened to this place? Whoever opened that. <laughs> okay, that guy's distracted behind me. <clears throat> Who caused that noise? Huh? Now it's my turn. All right. <laughs> oh, dang it. I was looking for whatever. I thought I had a flashbang. But it didn't pay to be looking through my tool belt as I'm being assaulted by them. I should have just fought them. I'm good at that. Get this door open! Break it down if you have to! Thief! Alright, well, we know he takes I a while. I have a ring and a new best friend. But it's not over until I get out of here. Incendiary arrow. Choke arrow. I guess I don't have any flashbangs. Did I not pick any up? And they're not even flashbangs, are they? They're like uh, choke grenades or something? I don't know. But I guess I don't have any. So... That sucks. So yeah, they heard the noise of me doing that aerial takedown. Now I'm seeing things, am I? Yes. Can I get out of here? Another guard that way. Well, I sneak out here to hunt the big rats on our Zelda. It was abandoned back then. Since the Baron moved all industry across the river to Cinderville, it's his dream. Automation, he called. Or oh, metal in misery, it hear you say now it happens. Oh, before we made it a crime to mouth off about the Baron. The furnace is the hardest work of year. <clears throat> nice and quiet. I feel like I'm close to having escaped this place. Doggy? No. It's a cage, but... Sounds like the general's men finally found the switch. Took him long enough. Best way out from here? <clears throat> nope, can't climb this. <laughs> I can't get up through there. way from here, Garrett. Which way are we going? We're going out this way. We're really close. It is not obvious. Alright, I'm looking up. Let's try looking at the ground level. I came in from here. And I've got to exit this way. That is an annoying sound. Can't climb this, can't jump on that. Can swoop around all I want. Ah, there's a window out. It looks like I can climb this pillar, but no, that's not the case. This 
pipe, perhaps? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Let's keep moving here. I think I'll repel down from here. No? Get here. Jump backwards. Maybe I'll go this way. Come on, Garrett. Work with me here, man. It looks like this is where I'm supposed to be. Maybe there's a pipe on the other side. <coughs> ah, what the? Didn't mean to do that. Nope, that's the only pipe. So that's where we're going. <coughs> yep. <coughs> This way... Looks like down is the next step. Okay, so, yeah. You have to press X to get down. I can repel further down, or I can just do this. Alright, that was a little strange. But a learning experience. No! At least I didn't notice that. Well, I'm full up on food. Sir. Somebody searching with a torch here? Oh yeah. You bet. And they're moving quick. Out and straight across to my right. There isn't a high ground option this time. No water arrow. Which way do I want to go from here? I want to cut around behind that box, that I do. Hmm, but he's got the light. Oh, I don't have a bottle or anything. I might actually have to put a broadhead arrow into somebody here. Or just make a break for it. If I could pick up a bottle or something, that'd be really useful. Maybe there's something in here. Some kind of help. What is this? Oh, that's food. Can I sneak around behind this guy? That guy's got the crossbow. Ah. What a situation to be in. Well, I do have this choke arrow. I'll find the friggin' bastard. That was fun. No matter where he hides, find him. Got another one. And it's straight ahead there's a staircase with a door that probably leads out that place. Where's this guy? Wasn't he just here? He was. But he won't see me here. I don't mind dogs barking or anything. <laughs> because there's already an alarm sounded, yeah?
back to the high ground. And that will get me outside. Light, light, light. What's in here? Which way do I want to go? This is the direction I want to be. It's a wall of good night. Can't say what is this place. You and me both, Garrett. Wow. That was a horrible mission. Yeah. They did a good job with the atmosphere in this in this particular level, man. <laughs> Made me feel uh rather queasy throughout most of it. So let's see. Ten combat takedowns. Wow. I like that they've got all of these challenges and statistics. It makes it a second playthrough feel kind of appealing, but I really don't want to go through that mission again. That was just disgusting. I felt I don't know, the way they were treating the dead and the way everybody was there. I mean, I realize it's just a game. These aren't... This is, I, I don't know, though, man. It's just... <laughs> I can't explain it. Just their actions inside the place, and... I don't know. Garrett handled that a lot better than I did. I guess it's... I don't want to say this is run-of-the-mill for him, because this doesn't seem like his typical job, but he really doesn't let any kind of outside factors affect him in his mission. He's a better thief than I would be. <laughs> All right, so 200 gold for that. That's pretty sweet. Let's go ahead and hit continue. I don't want to play that again. I agree, Tip. The high ground is ideal for moving around undetected. Oh, now I'm in the clock tower. Collection display updated. Okay, so there's that. I'm going to end this particular session here and then pick up fresh and new with the next session. Once again, as I said probably last episode or a couple episodes ago, because I do record these in, in long sessions sometimes, I'll probably play like an hour or two and then I'll take that uh, footage and I'll break that up into separate videos. So I probably mentioned at least one or two videos ago that uh, my, voice, my, my voice sounded like it was a little bit strained, so if you guys notice that, that's because I've been doing a little bit of extra commentary recently. So there's that. I had a really good time regardless, even though all of the negative factors about that mission, uh, I felt I didn't do too badly as far as, you know, all the thief stuff was concerned, having to do all that. And I got to play around with the choke arrow, which was actually kind of neat. In any case, that'll do it for this... <laughs> I'm still a little bit disoriented. That'll do it for this particular session. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.